I know it's Beat the Creek, and that's a huge attraction there, but Beat the Barn. That is huge. The barn has got so much overhead stuff, and that's what this video is about. I take this truck right here. Now, it's all dirty because of the rest of Trail 4, but that's another video because this is all about the barn. Let's get to the action. Yeah, I don't think I would have wet that shit barn. Oh, it's wet. You can't get up that dry, really. I watched people sitting in the struggle on that yesterday. Not too bad right there. It's just kind of crazy when you get really up there, you know? I like how it twists you back and forth as you go up. Mm -hmm. Let's change this if we were inside there the configuration. We change it up while Oh, this is new. This was something different last time. I heard some people were having issues right here. Up on the other point, going off over there. Oh, right here for a little bit, yep. Yeah, especially the narrow TF2s. Yeah. I can see them having a little bit of an issue there. Yeah. Gotta get back a little bit. Oh yeah, see right here, the big one seven R Larlo would not do very good here. Oh, look at that slide right there. That see that? This is where you all spot your truck. Look at that. I slid over and caught into that. We straighten you out? Yeah, yeah, please. There we go. Yeah, this slippy rope right I think here. the cage kind of caught me a little bit and pulled me right into it. Ooh. Oh, yeah, if you even get near that wall, it twists and dumps you right out. Yep. That's the spot that got me right there. At least in my hands. Somebody else's hands may be different, yes? But you're no winch cop. I freaking murdered him. But that's what it's going to be from now on in the future, just to let everybody know. <laughs> my mind, it's over. I'm not there to play no more. <laughs> nice driving, dude. I got the smallest one of the bunch this time. But the most yeah, yeah. Wow, small tires too. Yeah, I got the uh, these are the new 419s at least. They got really soft inserts in them though. They felt really nice too. They, they are really cool. soft. So the question is, you put the firm foams in the front or the rear? Firms are in the rear. Well, if all you're doing is climbing, all the weight's on the back end. Yes, so you kind of got to set it up accordingly. Watch my angles of the dangles here. Now there, I'm allowed to build a basket. Oh, wow. Did you zip that right out of there, Ethan? Yeah. Like this? There it goes. I didn't really get the full hurdle. And he had to shake it. I kept falling. Oh, wow. Nice. 
That's where you don't want a real top heavy truck. So that's kind of what I was worried about. Getting the skid over this one, because it's such a low vehicle. I guess I should grab like better trucks. They have fun to that. I just can't see beating up a truck that pops so perfectly. And I swore I'd never be that guy. It's okay to be that guy from time to time. Yeah, it's like the barn and the creek are the two main attractions, I think. The barn and what? The creek down there. The creek, you got to way down the aisle way to get it. But nine, we did the creek yesterday. I did the creek a, a few times with a few different trucks. Had to put all new bearings in both trucks. One of them was a rift. I don't have good luck with water and bearings, man. My water and bearings, I always had to put bearings in it. This is new. And we built this whole thing, it looks like. We used to have a, a light. All the work we got to see it keep it up. He takes a two month break, I think he said. It's over before he starts. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, where am I going here? I looked at him going all the way across. Two months after I thought of selling my shop, came up in and sold for millions. Wow. <laughs> Nice. Okay. He sold it to one of his guys who was working for him for years. So is this like his full-time thing now? Yeah, he's retired. Yeah. Nice. I retired too, but I'm working more. <laughs> yeah, it's the play working. A little different. A little bit. I do enjoy what I do. So you, when you get where you're at, though, you, oh. I see all the nonsense you have to deal with. Well... Like I told people, you can't do what I do if you have thin skin. That is way up there. Where are you guys at? I want one of y'all to fall off of this so I can get some good video. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you come over here in a little while during the day, you'll find that. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. See, it was a massive pile of trucks in fact. Hey, uh, the fit. Not me, buddy. Not, but not long after the death stopped, it's like, even Barton was like, this is gonna bad back, you know? And then, now it's gonna, you know don't burn up no matter what that's gonna put your foot through. I know people won't love because of that, but like you were pulling in the beginning, and now I'm gonna stop pulling. Oh, boo-hoo. I'll have probably 15 of these fusions. Stuff burns up, and it's a part of the, uh, That is it. I bought new stuff, burned it up next week, didn't buy new stuff. You make a mistake, if it does something, there's really no. I feel killing everybody's no warranty in this hobby. Huh. Well, it's not the warranty, it's the self responsibility when you go out and blow something up, then you go try to get warranty on it when it's your fault. Yeah. When, 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 I hit a, when I hit a pole or something, it's on me. 99% of all my failures are my fault. Simple as that. There's rarely I get a... I still want to do the X-Max race at the Exoplex. We just take the bodies off. Everybody's driving who knows what. I think that's like one of the most picture spots that's ever been done here. If this thing falls off, I'm chunking it back up there. <laughs> Oh, my truck.
Hey, you want pictures of just yours up there first? No, we get all of them, man. Yeah. Let's get them all in there. <laughs> That's me. I want everybody in there so I can look back and remember all of them. And me by myself just ain't that. Right. I got plenty of video of me by myself out here. Or at least at the Exoplex. <laughs> A little bit spooky looking. I can't see that. And there's a spot where this fence kind of like works together and I can't see it. Or I'm just getting really old. I'm not going here this way. Little CJ7's been doing good though. Little 4.19 tusks. Are you knocking people off over there? I've asked them about three inches. Right there. Right there. Look at all that. I, I want to be a prime sponsor next time. There you go. I think I want to be a prime sponsor next time. What is the difference? Probably where you get your banners and stuff. And your logos on the uh, their big banner and stuff like that. Possibly placement. Exactly. This Especially with this. And yeah, and with this being my one year anniversary event, which is what it is. Next year? Well, no, this is my one year anniversary event of leaving my job. Oh, yeah. So this is my one year. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Yes, yeah, so this is kind of like uh, it's got to be a thing for me now. <laughs> It's just scary leaving leaving the security to a complete almost unknown. There's I've worked all 21. I've worked all 21. <laughs> this is the end of it right here, dude. Oh, I thought it was challenging. No, it's just kind of scary if you fall off. That's right. Okay, so do we want to go one at a time or just all of us just bunch up and go? Bunch up and go if we can all I slide down at once. once. If we all can if slide down all at of once. Sliding down at one time, that would be mega epic, man. I think it would be. Well, it's like, all right, my my. Let's let everybody get lined up. Hold up. All right, my front tire is on it. As soon as you see me go, you yeah, guys just go. throttle out and go. Let's see if this is a catastrophe or genius. <laughs> Are y'all ready? Yeah. All right, here I go. Go, go, go. Oh, oh. <laughs> nice. I got to tell you, you really got to watch what you're doing in the barn. I'm, I, I got to tell you, it's, uh, you'll fall off of that stuff. So you just take your time. Drive easy and be careful. When I was at the far back trying to get the distant shot of the side of the barn, I could not tell whether I was going to the left or to the right. You kind of got to be somewhat underneath it to see all that. But regardless, nothing crashed. I'm happy with that. Check that description. Use those links. Hit that subscribe. Ring that bell. And I want you guys to have a wonderful day. If you're still watching, you are top shelf. You are the cream of the crop, the pick of the litter. You are phenomenal. Thank you for watching to the end of the video. It means a lot to me. Now, down below, there are links for the products you see. Also, for channel memberships, if you guys want to be a part. Channel members get early viewing on pretty much everything that I can. So, guys, check that description. There's a lot of info down there. Thank you all for watching.